In today's episode, I'm joined by a boss, Josh. Hello. We explain to you guys the difference between Ambrosia Mental Jewels and Ambrosia Ritual AM. <laughs> Boss Josh, yeah, man. welcome back. Thank you. Our Thank resident you. supplement specialist. Man, Ambrosia doing some really good things in the industry, yeah. some really innovative type products, opening up new doors to new category of products that we haven't seen before, which inherently creates, I wouldn't necessarily say confusion, but let's go with interest yep, yeah, into, okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, like into the different categories that they're playing with. And one of the questions that I get a lot is what's the difference between mental jewels mm. and ritual AM? Yep. And I think the reason why people are, uh, are interested in this is because both of them really are marketed at cognitive function, yeah. right? At helping you get the best out of your brain. They're yep. definitely not you know, f based on increasing physical performance as such, like mm. we used to seeing with pre-workouts yeah. and amino acids and protein More powder, on salt and so forth. Mental biohacking side it's, of things. It's, exa that's yeah. exactly right. You hit the nail on the head, the biohacking side of things. So I get a lot of questions mm. about what's the difference between the two, which one's better, which yep. one should I take? So let's hit them. Yeah, cool. All right. So if we just look just straight off the tubs themselves, mental jewels. Yep. They're calling it a cognitive function beverage. Yes. Whereas on the other hand, we have Ritual AM calling it a morning biohacking theorem, which yes. is a nice fancy word to use. Absolutely. So if you break down the main formulas, looking mm -hmm. at mental jewels, mm -hmm. I guess you could call that the closest thing to your typical nootropic style formula. Exactly. Yeah. It's, a, it's a nootropic. It's yep. targeted at increasing brain function yep. transiently for a period when you have the need for increased brain function, mm. right? Yep. So mental jewels is like you're going to sit down and you're going to get stuck into you know, some sort of work that's gonna that's gonna test you yeah. psychologically, it's gonna test you mentally, it's gonna require concentration, it's gonna require focus. Yep. That's when you take your mental jewels, right? right. Because it's gonna help your brain function yep. at that higher level yep. for that period of time. Yep. It's a nootropic. It is. Yeah. A unique formula in tropic, but yep. in tropic nonetheless. Absolutely. That's it. Whereas you bring in your ritual AM yep. and we'll get back into it a bit later, but while it does yield cognitive benefits yes it is sort of if people viewers are familiar with the idea of a bulletproof coffee yes that is essentially a high fat coffee yep. shot of coffee butter mct oil yeah so you're, you're really fast digesting or fast utilizing fats mm -hmm. and the theory behind that is you get this surge of energy the caffeine the the fat mix the yep. the source of the fats you get this clear sort of state of mind yeah you feel mentally alert mm -hmm. and you don't get the crash from from having a, a sugar crash or a blood yes. sugar spike and yep. then crash after that yeah so the ingredients in ritual am you've got your bhb salts which are known to raise ketone levels exogenous ketones, exogenous right? ketones. Yeah, yeah that's it essentially you're gonna get that as well as that you do get your mct powder as well as some clean cream in this mm -hmm. so it's been designed to either be used by itself but ideally mixed in with your coffee in the morning yep so you are essentially making yourselves a bulletproof coffee but it's more of a much more supercharged it's it's, Absolutely. it's way more being able to have the ketone salts in there mm -hmm. you're going to be able to get those cognitive effects yep of ketones. So I guess the first, you know, we've been through the ingredients, mm. but I guess the, you know, one of the main differences is in terms of when you take it. Yeah. Right? Ritual yeah. AM, as the name suggests, is supposed to be taken first thing in the morning. Yep. Before you consume anything else, yeah. right? So you're supposed to take it fasted. Yep. Every morning and it becomes your AM ritual. Part of your ritual. Right? Exactly. Whereas mental jewels, you can take it in the morning if you want, yeah, absolutely, yeah. but it doesn't need to be taken first thing in the morning yeah. on an empty stomach before you eat anything as a ritual. Yeah. Right? You can take it whenever. Absolutely. So in terms of when you actually take the products, there's quite a significant difference yeah. there. The other thing that I think perhaps people get a little bit confused with is because ritual AM is is really marketed as being mixed in with your morning coffee. Mm. Does Ritual AM contain stimulants itself? No. Stimulant no, free. No, stimulant free, yeah. Right? So there's no caffeine in Ritual yeah. AM, whereas there is caffeine in Mental Jewels. Correct. So if you wanted to have Ritual AM, mm. I mean, you don't have to have it with coffee. No, no, right? no. Right? No, no, you know, it's just how itself. it's kind of marketed because, you know, 
A lot of people get up first thing they do in the morning before they eat anything is they have a coffee, coffee so you may as well throw it in but you don't have to you can mm. have it with water they even now do an orange juice flavor yeah they do yeah that obviously you don't want to be having with coffee <laughs> oh, you just coffee. want to be having with yeah. water but the one thing to point out with ritual am is it is caffeine free it is yeah. stimulant free so unless you're mixing it with you know a coffee that has natural caffeine you're not going to get any stimulant effect from yes. it yes one of the things that 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 people then ask me is they go okay well you know they're both kind of targeted at increasing psychological performance mm. which one's better which oh. one should i take i don't want to take both which one should i take which one should i invest in i just on a general sense, yes. I'm going to pick mental jewels. You're going to pick mental. I think so there because you go. because it just it's more versatile yep. and probably more probably more effective mm -hmm. at providing that cognitive enhancement. Yeah. Um, I think Ritual AM is amazing, and I personally love using Ritual mm. AM. It's very unique. Yeah, very very unique. But I think it really. I mean, if you're someone, especially, I mean, if you're someone out there that's an intermittent faster, mm -hmm. or you're a high fat diet lover, mm -hmm. or a keto diet lover, mm -hmm. you would benefit so highly from Ritual AM. Yeah, like you. That is like that is your jam. Seriously, yeah. that would be your sort of thing. But Absolutely. Personally, I think mental jewels. Look, I've taken both. Yeah. Um, you know, I, obviously I use a lot of the supplements <laughs> that we sell here, almost all of them. Yeah. I've taken both. I'm a massive fan of Ritual AM when I'm having it. And, you know, depending on what phase of my diet I'm mm. in, depending on where my meal timing is, if I haven't, I have it fasted with coffee before yeah. I eat. The effects are great. Yeah. Really, really good. You do feel in the zone you yeah. feel elevated psychologically it's a great great supplement the one thing the one downfall is as you've said the versatility so yeah. if i'm you know at my phase of my diet now i get up the first thing i do is eat yeah right exactly. so there's no period between me getting up having a coffee mm. and then you know being able to get those benefits for an hour two hours yeah. three hours whatever it is before i have my first meal so for me right now that doesn't suit what i'm doing yeah but I'm still taking mental jewels. Yes. Right? Exactly. Because mental jewels is more versatile. You can take it any time of day. It doesn't need to be built into your ritual. You don't have to take it fasted. Yep. Uh, and it's a fantastic nootropic. It is. So I would say, I wouldn't necessarily say one is better than the other. No. I think you need to look at your circumstances. Yeah. Yeah. Right? If you're the sort of person where your morning routine looks like get up, have a coffee, don't eat for a few hours, mm -hmm. then man. Ritual I am is going to suit that perfectly. Absolutely. Whereas if that's not your morning routine, then you're really not going to be able to use Ritual I am the way it's yeah, designed to it. be used. Yeah. So in that case, I think Mental Jewels is going to be the better pick. Yeah, man. So it depends on your personal circumstances. Yeah. Bosh, anything else you'd like to add? No. Before I tell the viewers to hit the subscribe button, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to turn your post and notifications on both on your mobile, your cell phone, and your desktop PC. So you don't miss a beat when it comes to the Massive Joe's YouTube channel. Bosh, thank you once again. Not my pleasure. Always a pleasure having you for the viewers on an episode of MJ Every Day. Guys, until tomorrow, coming to you from MassiveJoe's.com. Stay massive. Thank you for tuning in to this video. We hope you enjoyed watching. Don't forget to check out our latest upload and our recommended video and be sure to subscribe to the Massive Joe's YouTube channel to stay up to date with all of our latest uploads.